What's up guys, Zaf here back with some more on Muji. Um, I've been sick for the past few days, that's why there's been no videos. I'm still sick, I just finished my Netherworld gate. And, um, but I think uh, it's about time we do a video. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to share with you guys how you can contribute to your guild. Um, first off, we're going to look at the two things that make up the guild ranks. The two things are dual score rank and guild active rank, right? Okay. So, if you can look at info in the in the guild tab, info. The first thing that affects guild ranking is dual score. So the more you duel, the higher your score, the higher your guild will rank. Number two would be feet. All you have to do is just click on this sort thing here, and it'll change to feet. So weekly feet, you can get a maximum of 700 weekly feet. I'm going to share with you guys how you can do that. And also why this feat is important. First, we're going to hit the shrine, right? Go to group quests. Then there's three different quests that you can choose from a day. Um, this is my personal views. It's got nothing to do with the guild or how it is. It's just my personal views on how uh, people should you know, do their feet. So usually you'll get these kind of quests and then there's another one which is a company a company gives you this orochi scales but i don't quite recommend that because you know we get a lot of orochi scales from farming soul 10 itself so it's best to do these kind of quests where it says um, fire wheel or anything that gives this box because it gives a random dharma shard um let's see submit how many we can submit today oh i only have five well i'm in a hurry so we're just going to do to submit two of those and you can see oh we got blue Dharma shards so for the first 10 quests you get double the rewards and now I'm not gonna submit create five souls I'll, I'll just submit this win talismans because I I've, I can't farm anyway today <laughs> so from here yeah we can get feet right so feet again how you can get it is from doing group quests um, you can also get it from going to guild then uh, donating this button right here you can donate up to 100 jade a day so if you donate one time yeah it grants you 10 feet and 20 guild medals so guild medals and feet are what gives the ranking of guilds to go up so i'm gonna donate five right here which is 100 jade right that will bring my tally of feet up to 690 uh, so that as you can see we donated we got 50 feet from there we got 40 from doing the guild quest which was actually 30 plus the, f the first 10 is a bonus of 10 so making it 90 total and the last one you can get by going to demon encounter right see th this is one thing that i forgot to do for the past two months yes truth be told i only found out about this uh, last week people were laughing at me when i, I said i just found out about it Right, so what I did was, I did, I've been doing my four daily demon encounters, right? But the one thing I didn't do was click on this red Daruma here, this raking, this shaking red Daruma. I did not know that this is how you're supposed to do it. You're supposed to click on it and there you'll get like 40 sushi, 10 feet, some gill medals and some other medals and about 35,000, 35 to 40,000. This varies, you know, all these varies except for the gill medal and feet. So yeah, I haven't done that. I'll do the rest of my demon encounters later. We're just gonna go through the video. Right. So now you can see my feat for the week is 700. Okay. So 700 is achievable. If you do not have Jade to donate, it's fine. You can still get 350 weekly feats, right? Uh, but people have been complaining. They said that, uh, you know, it takes a lot of energy, <clears throat> a lot of AP to farm these things. But, see, I came from playing Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes and we had to have like 600 energy a day for tickets. So I think if you're supposed to farm like, let's say Firewheel 3, Firewheel 2, right? You go in, you can get one Firewheel 2 per run. Let's just assume you're only getting one per run. One and it takes four AP per run. So 30 times four is only 120 AP, but people are still complaining about that, you know? I, I think people should be slightly selfless and just do all 30 guild quests a day. I mean, again, this is my personal opinion. You know, I'm, I'm like, by hook or by crook, I will still have to do 30 guild quests a day to me. 
So that's how I managed to get uh, maximum weekly feeds. And why is this feed important? So you can go to Shrine, you can see the feed shop here, right? So what I can get from my weekly feeds is uh, once your guild levels up to level five, you can get this shard pack, right? So um, I got five. You can get three to five shards of Black Daruma shards a week, and it only costs two hundred feet. And you get one mystery amulet, two G three Great Darumas, and I still have leftover of two hundred and seventeen, which um, I guess I'll buy some feed packs. See what we get from here. Even for it. Took it. Ten thousand coins. Oh, great Daruma. 10,000 coins, seven. It's alright. I mean, um, apart from that, alright, I digress. Apart from that, what else can you do? Um, this feet. What, uh, feet and guild medals, right? So they're important because then the guild leader can buy these guild packs, alright? And there you may get Jade, Darumas, and other items, which I actually have a few guild packs to, to collect. But let's try and see what I get from here. Uh, so I got 100 Jade, I've got 3 base Darumas, 1, 2, 3, 4, 40k coins and a couple of broken amulets. Which is not bad, that's why I say like average per day I would get about 100 Jade because my guild leader sends out 2, uh, I think I think 2 guild packs a day, if I'm not mistaken, is that a 1 or 2? So yeah, so so that 100 Jade I'll get back and I can always like put it back to, to, to donating to the guild, you know? What is this? Oh, another world quest rewards. What do we get? Rubbish again. Oh, three shards. Nice. Right. Okay, back to how else you can help with the guild is we're going back to shrine. Our guild achievements. There's a lot of things that you can do. Alright. One thing that you can do is every day chat chat once a day in guild chat you see guild members chat 8,000 times in the guild yeah, th this one is, is level 4 already so it's like every guild member should just go to the guild you know you can just put one dot do one chat a day that's it that's all you need you need to just chat once a day and after that you can check other stuff you know this co-op and everything that gives you points and this will help the guild grow then there's also growth where you you can g6 uh, a shikigami you know well, someone's done this. What this? Uh, someone G6 uh, Samurai X. Someone G6 Shuzu. Um, so on and so forth. You know, they, they have this weird Shikigamis that you'll never G6. But yeah, they, they are part of the quest. And when you, do, when you do so, you get all these points. And these points will then help your guild level up. Yes. Uh, what's next? Mm, guild gives blah, 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 blah. I think that's about it oh yeah apart from that all right will be the other stuff the other stuff would be co-op duels when you go to co-op duels um, your guild also you also get um, jades this is for yourself too uh, for your guild ranking so that means the more co-op uh, duels you do and the higher your score the higher your guild's co-op duel score would be and then peep you know you you'll get crystals at the end of the week for that then uh, you can also, well, be helpful in guild chat. You know, if people ask questions, reply them. You know, have a guild discord or something, join it, and then... I know, I know, some people will be saying, like, this is just a game, you know, you don't want you want, you don't want it to take over your life, you know, having to have discord and this and that, but... I mean, I've been playing a lot of different games, and I feel that having an organized guild is much better than having a super, super casual guild. Because although, although you might be a very casual player, but I think um, camaraderie is, is one of the aspects of the game, which is really great. <clears throat> and um, I'm losing my train of train of thought here. I had a lot of other things to say, but I just can't recall them right now. So I'm just going to sign out. I do apologize again. I'm still hella sick. You know, if in two days this sickness doesn't go away, I'm going to go to check myself in the hospital. I'm just afraid that it might be dengue or something. But yeah, guys, uh, that's all for today. This is off signing out then.